Hello and welcome to my review of the Little Zoo X Trails Rat, Ferret and Chinchilla Cage. Uh, I brought this, let's turn the light on. There we go. That light hasn't really made much difference. That'll do. I bought this for rats. I've got two of them, uh, two females, uh, Snow and Ellie. But uh, they're in their normal, they're in their old cage at the moment. While I review this, because uh, I've not put anything in it yet. So uh, it's pretty big. It is 159 tall by 93 wide and 63 depth. These are all centimeters. Uh, it has one, two, three, four, four. Uh, four levels comes with three adders and it comes with two hammocks uh, I've got one hammock in there they're pretty decent hammocks good quality uh, what you get uh, you have the clock face lock with a little hinge at the top so they can't open it uh, the bar width is 15 cent 15 millimeters I'm not sure if my rats can squeeze through it yet I will be finding out tonight if I have any escape rats. Uh, the trays are removable. And you see uh, we have a, uh, we're using fleece. And what we've done with our fleece is, uh, where can I get a bit? Let me go here. I should have done it before this. Uh, we have stuck it down with Velcro. Uh, we would have used binding clips, but uh, I found that Velcro was easier. It's a bit more expensive, but it will keep it stuck down. Uh, if not better than uh, binding clips, because uh, my rats tend not to chew the uh, chew the stuff. Now uh, the cage, uh, we was we did find it a bit annoying putting it together first. Uh, uh, but other than that, once we got it together, we realised it's a simple, simple to put together. Uh, it comes on a stand. It is not held down by anything, just to be warned. So if you've got any large animals like the chinchilla uh, or ferrets, and they're rather lively, they could, I could maybe say knock it off, but I doubt it. But there's a possibility. Uh, the only other downside with this was this tray here. I'll get this tray out without knocking the ladder off. Oh, wrong way. This tray is the same size as the bottom tray, right? Now, this tray did not come with the cage. It come with that bottom one, and it come with this one over here. But if we put this one in, throw it down for a sec. So if we put this one in. It leaves gaps on either side, and it's not very secure, so they can, rats could easily squeeze through there. So what we did, we got in contact with the, with the uh, seller, and we explained this, and they were very, very helpful, and uh, they said uh, send us another bottom one out. Unfortunately, we had to cut it ourselves. That hole normally is on the other side over there, but we cut it out there. For the rats and uh so they can come in so yeah that's the cage guys uh pretty big and i'll just show you what they're in at the moment i would do editing but i ain't the sort of person to be bothered to edit at the moment <laughs> this is the cage they're coming from so they're gonna love it in this new cage aren't you guys aren't you girls aren't you there's one of them that's snow at least asleep as usual so Thanks for watching guys, and uh, hopefully I'll give you an update video in about a week's time to see how the rats are getting on. But thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time, and bye.